midfielders now. Again, the thing with this England midfielder, it depends on how we're going to play and how many. Yeah, we're that box. That you know, that box. I think yeah. a lot of players. Are, when you look, there's a lot of players who are guaranteed to go there. I think uh, Henderson, Ali Henderson, guaranteed, Henderson, Dyer. Um, that's all really. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going really now. Chamberlain's out. Uh, no, we, we, we mentioned you, Henderson, Ali, and and, and, and and Dyer are guaranteed to go. People have mentioned Jack Wilshere isn't. Um, um, Jack oh. Jack Wilshere has. I know. Oxford Chamberlain's out. Jack Wilshere, out of all the England midfielders, has to go. And like, let me tell you something right now. He's played in in the Premier League. He's played 20 games. He has the best pass completion rate out of all the players. In less, what's his name? In, in less games. What does, what does that tell you? I mean, yeah, but but look at the. I mean, Deli Ali maybe is a different one, but he plays further forward. But in terms of the deeper lying role for some of those players, I'm not seeing the kind of technical. I think he kind of stands alone. In that he, he can't, but again, people. You're going to need to keep the ball in the World Cup. I, I don't, I don't, this rigid thing, you're going to need to keep the ball for a few minutes yeah. playing against Brazil. If you do not have the ball, you're not going to win the game. People talk about playing with counter attack. You're going to need players who have the ability to find that pass. But you look at England in the major competitions over the past however long, we dominated the ball. Absolutely dominated the ball, but we've not won the game. But again, that's why I'm going the opposite. Yeah. I don't, I don't think, going back where but we when you play against the top teams, England are not going to have that much of the ball playing against a, a Brazil. Playing. Spray balls, yeah. their friends and all. Mm-hmm. I remember exactly. the also against um, man, another big team, but Scotland. Mm-hmm. And the spray balls ring like left, right, center. Yeah. The assist. Also, with that, if if Wilshere wasn't at that team, they wouldn't have probably won out. Like, I'd take him off the bench if we need a goal, but it doesn't start for me. Okay, okay. And I like Jack Wilshere. I'm big. I always. In my opinion, it's it's a bit of an Arsenal bias. He's, the best bias player. Player. he's your best midfielder. I, I, I want him to go. See, I disagree. I think he's. Second or third. Who's better? I think Eric Dyer is number one, and I think Henderson's second. I don't really well, guys, you can leave a comments down below there. Who is third? third Ali, Ali's fourth. Ooh, that's a. Is Eric Dyer start or Tottenham? Yes. No, yes, he does. Well, no, but some days, but that Tottenham's a very weird one because some days you might have Wanyama, you might have I'll tell you the reason why I like Eric Dyer as well. Like I said, and this is this goes back to my the way that I think we play, not a prediction. It's who I would the way I would play the game. I want us rigid to physically, I want midfielders to be midfielders. I don't need this attacking hybrid. I want midfielders to just dominate midfield. I want defenders to defend. That's why I can't have Wilshere go and be half an attacker, half a midfielder. I want two players in Dyer and Henderson to just be, we're big, we're strong, and we can do a job. I'm, again, no. I'm, I'm trying to win games here. I'm trying to win games. That's, 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 my, that's my thing. If we need a goal to equalize the game, Jack Wilshere's first name on the game. Okay. Again, he's, he's and he goes, he goes, he goes, for okay. sure. I'm just going to mention a couple. Yeah. Does Alan Lana go to the World Cup? No. no. no? So. Uh, Mikel Antonio? No. He, if he was fit, I'd love him to go, but no. no so. Loftus Cheek? No. I wouldn't take no. him. No. Jake Livermore? <laughs> no. <laughs> I, I mean, this is. Um, this how, is how, many, how many midfielders, central midfielders are you I'm taking central midfielders. Five, five, five. 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 I'm five. taking so, Ali Dyer. So, so far we've got Henderson. three keepers. Ali, Dyer, Henderson, Wilshere. So we need one more name. The, the, the three keepers. I can take Shelby and Kev. I'm, I'm going I'm gonna have, this is my wild card out of it. And we're going to get everyone to do it. But this is my wild card. I'm taking John Joe Shelby. Yeah, fuck it. I'll do that. He's not my wild card, but if for a fifth spot, for somebody to get fired up and get in a game and try and win a game, yeah. When it comes to breaking lines, yeah. he is your best. I'm passer. Jack Wilshere is the best passer overall. When it comes to play, passing the ball forward it's and finding twenty yards, yeah. he's he is fantastic at that. He has, he, he's the best. He's the best by this. And for me, if you're talking about performances, he has deserved it. You know. Is there anybody in there who, who we're kind of missing from elsewhere in the league? Oh. Lewis Cook, I would throw out there. Lewis Cook deserves a shout. He it's wouldn't good. go, but yeah. I'm surprised he's not in that list. Um. Uh, I can't wait. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, guys, you can't. <laughs> uh, okay, so we've all really established that okay, we have Jack Wilshire, um, Ali, Dyer, Henderson, and. Probably John Joe Shelby. Yeah. Yeah. Difference maker, why not? Difference maker. Yeah, no, maker yeah. going, yeah, so, okay. Yeah. Now we're going to again leave your comments, your opinions, everything, alright? If all you have. Disagreements with me. All disagreements. If you want to take Tom Cleverly, <laughs> Don't leave a comment at least, alright? But <laughs> unsubscribe. <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah, we're gonna move on to the last one, and that's forwards. Again, 
There's a couple of locks. There's a couple of locks there. Yeah. Harry Kane, yeah. he's guaranteed to go. Again, Rash- who? Rashford. 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 Okay. Sterling's a guarantee to go. Vardy's a guarantee. How many could I have? The How last, many players are we taking now? Yeah, but, but, but the thing about this isn't striker, this is striker. Wait, 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 wait. We're covering yeah, yeah. a lot of okay, spaces okay. Um, oh, um, A few things first. Who's England captain going into the World Cup? Um, Henderson. I, Henderson. Henderson too. Well, a lot of people will say Harry Kane. We talk about intangibles, right? Mm-hmm. And we were talking about it with um, Joe Hart. For me, the intangibles that really are Skill alone and talent alone, Jordan Henderson doesn't make a squad for talent. I'm like, I'm just so underwhelmed by him. He's like, you know, I'm, I'm just yeah. not on board. As a leader and as a driver of a football team and as a captain of Liverpool, he's our captain. For me, for me. A lot of people will say Harry Kane. I, I uh, have strikers guessing, as captains, yeah. I'm not on board. No? You've got to see the game. That's why for me, it's got to be a goalkeeper, center back, or center mid. Winners and four backs. that captain down, buddy, you become Superman. <laughs> You know, it becomes, it gives him a lot more shoulders. Too much pressure on him. Too much, too much pressure? Yeah, okay, pressure. let's look through um, the um, players. James Vardy, go on. Definitely. Yeah, yes. right, but I'll shout without. Kane, I'm not even going to speak about that. Rashford, I'm not really going to um, I'm not really going to speak about that too. Sterling, Gar- um, I'm guaranteed. Probably your best threat going forward as in taking, um, taking the ball on and dribbling with it. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, I'll yeah. say Rashford, you know. Dribble, Rashford. Yeah. It, it depends where it depends where you are. Out yeah. wide I'd say Rashford. But through the middle I'd say Wilsh is a better dribbler than Sterling. But I don't, I don't know. Lin uh uh what Lingard. Well, I'm taking I'm Jesus. taking Jesse so Lingard. I, so I. I'm taking Jesse Lingard. 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 I'm not taking Jesse Lingard, I'll probably find a, a spot for him to start. I wouldn't start him, but for me, like it's scary how clutch Jesse Lingard is. For somebody who every time I watch I'm just so underwhelmed, I'm just like Ugh. he scores Volleys from outside the box to win cup finals. I mean, like, what? Look at his Wembley record. He, he's a big time player. Let's yeah. be honest. Some of the big games this season, he's oh, stepped oh, Welbeck. Welbeck for me goes. He's this player that I don't care what everyone can say anything you want to say about Danny Welbeck. Everywhere Danny Welbeck has been, even at England, he's always staggered. When Roy was there, he wouldn't make my squad. But but okay. So here's my here's my wild card because we're in this wild card. Okay, okay. My wild card is Ryan Cecil. Mm-hmm. Um, Nominated for Best Young Player of the Year, um, first ever outside the top league in the championship. Don't Incredible. Go he's, he's in the playoff final and it's going to be great. Wow. The reason why I play him there is because as a winger, we can also add that an extra defensive edge. Like I was kind of, and I'm not going to do some sort of tactical deep dive, but I kind of did it to you guys with a few mm-hmm. props earlier. When we come to a defensive shape, if we're playing forward and back, the left fullback can move to like a left centre back role, and then Cecilion can come in as a winger. Are you going to do that for just for one young player, a Walker? No, I, I would do I would do that when we're winning a game and we need to see out a game. Okay. So Rashford starts left wing, and then at 70 minutes we need to hold on to a one goal advantage. Yeah. On comes Cecilion for Rashford, and then that comes into play. Maybe okay. he's my wildcard. I would take him ahead of Welbeck and Walcott. Well, speaking of Walcott, does Walcott go? I, I, need, I, need to, I will take Walcott, the reason why it's yeah. sentimental reason. It's sentimental reason. This guy's missed out on two more goals now. Oh boy, let him, okay, let him at least go this way. Yeah, I'm, I'm a shot I'm, to be honest, <laughs> To be honest, he has the best shot accuracy out of all um, seven players. Um, I mean, seven candidates. I mean, <laughs> send the medal is I'm not taking it. Please don't take it. He hasn't like let like let him just play in a world. Let's, Yo, come on. Let's be let's be honest here. Kane starts at nine. No question. That's not even a joke. Vardy, if they play the if they do the two thing, maybe starts. But Vardy's probably the sub for Kane. Later yes, on when it gets a bit. Wait, wait. I'm actually this. If was fit, would that instead go? No, no. Because he'll get injured. First week, and then we'll be like, oh man, not a score of 23, a score of 22. <laughs> so I tried that, Daniel. Yeah, what, what was the year he was on the real? 2013. Yeah. Five years ago. I'm so over it. I'm done. It's over. He's not playing for England again. I'm, I'm so oh, over. Him yeah, and yeah, Defoe. Yeah. But last year, do not remember us. How, how we Crouch, were. get out of here. I'm done. Yeah, I'm so done. Came when he got injured. Yeah, like <laughs> nice faces. <laughs> no peak. So. Okay, Ruby, I've got to ask you this. Who is your walk card going into? My walk card. Wait. No, I don't. I don't be biased, but you know, I take main, main and else. 
team? He's better than every man. Yeah, why not? Is he even yeah. English? He's English. Yeah, he's English. I thought he was Jamaican. Well, he's Jamaican descent. Well, I'll yeah. take him in the house. Yeah. Maybe in the house. Yeah. To be honest, that's a decent show. I you know no one actually considered him. This is the thing. The, the number 23 in the squad. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to be mad at anybody really going. What about Tom? Honestly. What about Tom? Clemens? Tom Clemens, like, okay, maybe I'm going to go. But like, what I'm saying is that number 23 spot, which is because there's, keep in mind, 11 players play, you take 23. And True. you can only field a, a seven subs. So actually, there's five players who aren't even really going to truly make the bench. So those five spots for me, if you're going to take a punt on somebody, you could be a difference maker, like a Shelby, uh, like a Ryan Sessing, or like a who do you think that would not? What the hell? I don't know. What, why do question? Why do the team take three goalkeepers? I don't know. I think it's rash. I think it's because when you get one injury, you need to make sure you have a goalkeeper as a sub if one injury happens. I'm not, I'm not, I'm it's not. such a contingency plan. I would do two. I would do Same. Two. Like, I'll, I'll, I'll do two. Of risk because what? It's only yeah. a month. Let me tell you the reason why I'll take him. He's, he's a utility man. Utility. The thing is, he does. And, he and, bounce around. Yeah. and we've got to give a shout out like for Ox. Ox. That's savage. Yeah. That's savage. In my opinion, if he was fit, he stands. He's a top five, like you know when they go first name on the team sheet? He's like the top three or top five name on the team sheet. Like Kane won, but then maybe Ox might even be second. Like wow. think about it. He's for, for what he's been doing at Liverpool and for the way that I think he's been playing at the World Cup. Or, or you might, I right, forgot you. one player right now. No, he's he he's retired. But let's be honest. If we're going by form, James Milner has oh, to be in right. the team. I thought you said that Rooney. I was like, no, I said Rooney. <laughs> but Milner really should be in the World Cup team. No, he should, Milner, he should, Milner, Milner should go. Milner should go. Yeah, but will he come out of retirement? No, that's not. Rose Watson has come up. So Rose Watson has stuff. Zaha as well. Yeah. Oh, Wilf. Zaha. Oh no! I tell you why Wilf Zaha can't go because he's on Ivory Coast. Yes, you yeah. you, you messed up on that. He actually yeah. played for England. I'm, if Zaha. Oh, Tom and I. Oh no, he's Scottish. No, I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> Who's that? Andy. Who's that? I tell. Ah, uh, no, I will tell you another wild card. I don't know how long the video's going on for. Jack Grealish. Ah oh, no. Dude. Uh, for Villa this year, he's been yeah. very well. And he's, he's Irish. He's Irish. Just oh, leave it there. He's Irish. No, but didn't he say? Didn't he say English? I think yeah, yeah. He, he, he hasn't picked it yet. He's. I've watched a few Villa games. I've watched a couple of Villa games this year. He's a, he's a grown man now. Like he goes. Like, he's not just some like showboaty kid. Now mm. he, he's he's out there doing stuff to try and win games. Okay, guys. That's a wild card. Okay, we're gonna cut it short now. But before that, since we're talking about wild cards, I'm thinking he, he he's not in the World Cup this year. Why not we get Garbell? I mean. He's from the UK. No, I. This is what I'm saying. <laughs> this is what I'm saying. If like, I, I, and I want this to happen. I want the UK. I want it to be the UK. Is I want it to be, mate. Kieran Tierney, Andrew Robertson, Gareth Bale, Aaron Ramsey. I don't know who else I'm thinking of. Like, Actually, that's Williams. four serious players. That's four players. I mean, yeah, yeah. Okay, guys. Um, again, we've obviously ran down through the whole team. Again, give your opinion. The team's probably going to be out in a few hours' time, but we're not going to be able to see it. But again, I have got them all wrong. We probably got them all wrong. It's probably going to take Tom yeah. Clever to leave. Uh, no one's going. But again, leave your comments down below what you believe the England team's going to be. And again, I'm not going to say come on England, Jack. You're going to say come on England. Yeah, Nigeria guys. Oh, Nigeria. Good luck, to England, in a World Cup. And again. I'm getting that World Cup fever and, I'll, yeah. and, we'll, and we'll see you in Russia. I'm not actually going to Russia, but yeah. I'll see you in Russia, guys. Thank you very much. Yeah. In a bit. Thank you.